Welcome to the Super Starcraft Bros. And I'm the Friday. I'm Jay. And I'm Iron Sparks. And we got some diamonds for you today. Yep. Do you think the mineral minerals are diamonds? No, I think they're crystals. Do you think they grow back? Like the crystals you can grow in like the crystal sets? Like what makes these crystals so amazing you can make anything out of them? Well, just look at them. I mean, they glow. They're glowing. They shine when you mine them. They have like a shimmer in them. Yeah. They are very pretty. I bet they make really nice jewelry. I mean, if you touch them, they glow even more. Yeah, it's... It's like, like they're it's like, like they're you, alive. It's like you... And they're mad that you're drilling them apart. Like, you drill them, you wouldn't need any light while you're drilling, because it'll no. just illuminate the space around you. It'd be such safe mining right it's there. It's kind of like mining redstone. Yeah. It glows. So this is like bluestone. Lapis Lazuli. Whatever that is. Lazuli. All right. Well, guys, we have a TVP for you today on Aklon Ways. It's Diamond Friday. Hey, if you didn't see Thursday's Masters episode, you need to check it out. Because there was dancing and Destiny Cloud Fist and SEVs doing a ton of work and effective banshees. So, and even more dancing. And more dancing like, at the end. There's dancing marines. There's Yeah. And there's also a dancing command center. Yeah, you, you got to see that. And that so. really gets down. Uh, All right, you gotta check that out. So let's uh, let's introduce those players for Diamond Friday and get into this game. And our bottom right corner, we have our red Terran sheep. Nope, nope, nope. His name is Sheep. And sheep. his opponent, the blue Protoss, Monomo. Mono, 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 Mono. A Monomo sounds like a sophisticated cow. I am not a moo. I am a Monomo. <laughs> I'm still loopy, guys. You haven't noticed. Um, yeah, so Barracks is about to finish as well as a gateway first game of the day. Ah! Oh! You should put turn that frown upside down. Do you know how stressed out the first game of the day is? You know how stressed out any game of the day is? Well, the first game of the day really kind of decides if you get to a second game of the day. Because <laughs> if you lose the first game, you're like, you have a 50% chance to be like, alright, I'll, I'll do play another one. And then if you lose the second game, you're like, yeah, I think I'm done for now. Let's, uh, let's play some mono battles. <laughs> uh, if I lose the first game, I just stop. And that's why I haven't played in so long. Because I lost the last game, so <laughs> I, I can't play anymore. You know, Your body never got the reset. Your mind's like, sorry, man, we, just, we lost the first game. We can't do the other one. All right, so uh, let's see. We got the gateway down. Cybernex core is down for Monomo. We have the mothership core coming out of that lovely nexus placed over there. It's just, just so pretty. I and back at sheep we have a reactor going down we got a bunker so it looks like preparations for an expansion and we have a factory already so we'll probably see some fast hellions out of this I mean, look at the back of that factory works out does some crunches that eats a lot of burritos you see that fire right there all right we got the switch out now let's see what we got we have two hellions yep yep Warp yep gate is now on the way and we have an expansion for Monomo as well. These Hellions might be pretty effective uh, unless something gets out of a gateway for Monomo. Uh, it does look like he is going to do some scouting with the Mothership Core. Not a bad idea. And we do have a Stalker on the field as well. Did, did the Zealot come out as well? Or did he just go straight for the Stalker? Straight for the Stalker. Straight for the Stalker. That makes sense because that would have been all the money for the uh, Mothership Core. All right. Looks like Stalker does pick up the Hellions. Uh, gets them down at the beginning of the yellow on their health bars. And uh, back at the base, we do have another Stalker coming out. And uh, we do have a probe transfer. I don't know if this is the most ideal thing to do. I see what you're doing there. I I see. He's making a probe sandwich. Filled with the delectable, delightful meat of Hellion. But if you've ever been attacked by your turkey sandwich, it's not that effective. Are you sure? If the turkey's bad, it can give you some bad diarrhea. But, you know, turkey has the, that, uh, you know, like Pokemon that can put you to sleep. Dopamine? Yeah. Is that, is that, no, it starts with an A. It's, Dopamine's a different chemical in the brain. What is it? It's, uh, put to sleep amine. I just got really hungry. It's put thanks, to sleep amine. Thanks a lot. I just got really hungry. All right, here comes a couple of widow mines. That's, they just waltz right in. They, like, walked right past their distant cousins, the stalkers. <laughs> They're gonna plop right down into the mineral line. I love this. Uh, they are spotted. The probes are trying to do all they can to destroy these things before they can get burrowed. 
One of them gets down. Bam! That's a big old hit on that pack of probes. A lot of them go down. <laughs> and then just that one probe. And then the one probe. So that one would have mind's like, oh, that's not fair. Uh, Mother Ship Core does pop back out. There is a long reload time on these Widow Mines. Are you serious? Yeah, he seriously walked those into your base and burrowed them. Seriously. Seriously. You have another base. Just make them go down. Oh, we gotta reload. We gotta reload. And, oh, takes out a giant chunk of the Mothership Core life. But you know, now the Observer is going to be out very soon. It is being Chrono boosted <laughs> out. Don't know. You tell me. And uh, that excellent play. with. The, I can't believe that those things... It's not butter. What's up, son? What was that? Oil spread or whatever it is? I can't believe those two Widow Mines marched up into that base and planted themselves on either side of the middle line. Oh, nothing stopped it. Why do I have to play against you? Because I'm a home. He's a home. How, why did I deserve that? Like, is a home the new Bouse? <laughs> it went from boss to Bouse to house. And now we got BM. Well, um. Like, you're acting like there's nothing you could have done to stop this. When, I, when, when they walked up the ramp. You know what's better? You walked up, they walked up one ramp. Up to another ramp. You know, I think they even waved hello to that, that pack of stalkers that was out like, there. They even had their headlights on. Like, they were even driving safely. I know. They even looked both ways. They stopped at that stop sign back there. I know. They 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 provided right-of-way to the other guy, that, that Automatron 1000. It's like... It was, he, I know, I, I, yeah. It's I, not a surprise. Well, I mean, the thing, and too. And there weren't any at your expansion. I mean, Monomo knew there was Hellions, yet he didn't prepare anything to defend against additional harassment. He had that nifty move with the probes that got rid of the Hellions quickly. I Actually, liked it. Actually, that was kind of stupid, too. Like, it was hey, dangerous as hell. Let's move them from your mineral line into a line. I was getting worried because he lined them up. Yeah, it was like, so if the Hellions go left and then <laughs> zig back... You just lined up all your probes. Like, yeah, they're lined up, but then you just grouped them up against the Hellions. Oh, well. You guys leave a comment down below on how you think uh, Sheep did. I think Sheep did very well. Um, it's it's very rare that you find someone who wins through harassment. Like, that was good. And, like, he didn't even, con 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 like... <laughs> he didn't even have to do anything. He, he didn't, like, fully... Commit? Commit into this harassment. He he made his expansion. He had four Hellions um, and he, two Widow Mines. He built a... An army. Yeah. Oh, well. Well, great game, Sheep. Good job on that. Monomo, don't be a sour loser. All right, guys. Leave a comment down below. Hit the like button. Subscribe. Share. Favorite. We greatly appreciate it. We really, really would. Uh, send us in. Why do we always yawn when I say this? I don't know. But please send in your replay at... He's yawning. At superstarcraftpros <laughs> at cheapbuilt.com. Emails down below. Leave comments. Hit all the buttons. Send us replays. We'd love to cast them next week. Good luck. Have fun. Have a great weekend. GG.